This may be the last year that Indiana students have to take the I-STEP exam. Its replacement, the I-LEARN, would be given for the first time next school year. It would be a, a more vetted test and it would be, I guess, more accurate. And the current test, which was put together in a year, was too quick, and it wasn't really uh, vetted, and the test questions weren't tested with samples with students ahead of time. Indiana's Education and Career Development Chair Dennis Cruz says, I learn will be much more than just better questions. Students will take it once at the end of the year instead of twice a year. Indiana teachers will be able to grade the exams and they're getting rid of administrative glitches. State Representative Bob Morris says they'll be watching closely to make sure iLearn is clearly better than iSTEP. Listening to the teachers in, in Fort Wayne, we needed to do something in regards to iSTEP and the, the number of problems that we had with our, our private contractor that was issuing the test. This is very important for the students as well as the teachers in our, in our state. Southwest Allen County School Superintendent Dr. Phil Downs is happy the iLearn bill is making progress because he does not like the iSTEP exam. It's just been a mess. It's a mess. And it's, it's not been, we don't get any good information out of it. It's expensive as heck. It was not well put together. It was not well run. Um, there's a, Southwest has a long history of complaining about this. And it's time to use the flexibility that the feds, by getting out of this process, are giving the state and I think the Senate yesterday recognized that, and it's an opportunity for us to come up with a system that's going to be great for Indiana's girls and boys.